I'm back in downtown Fresno, and today I'm trying barbecue. And let's face it, we're Fresno, so this is Tri-Tip. Today, I have the treat of trying the people's choice of the Tri-Tip throwdown, just the tip. Let's do this. I'm Jason Ferris, owner of Fres Yes Realty, and I've lived in Fresno all my life. Join me as I visit some of the best food spots 559 has to offer. This is Fresno Flavor. Award-winning tri-tip is just the tip of the iceberg. Smoked turkey, pulled pork, and pastrami bring the heat for meat lovers of all types. These delicious meats, along with their sides and salads, are all made from scratch every day. Owner Mariah serves her lunchtime regulars, walk-in and delivery customers, competition-ready barbecue throughout the work week. I'm excited to grill her and learn more about this awesome establishment. Mariah, thank you so much for allowing me to come in today. I really appreciate it. I'm excited too, so. Just the tip. Right. Where'd the name come from? Give us some uh, little history here. So the previous owners, they had the building on a visitor of Tuolumne, and so it was kind of the tip of a triangle, looked kind of like a block of cheese. I know that building. A couple of bottles of wine, a couple of glasses of gin one night, and they decided, well, let's name it just the tip. We're selling tri-tip, right? But do we sell just tri-tip here? I sell smoked turkey. Uh, we do pulled pork, which is one of our more popular items as well. I do salads and wraps for, you know, the ones that are still holding out on their New Year's resolution as well. <laughs> <laughs> they need to be holding on. Mariah, so what are we having today? So we're going to do the Divisadero. Our four tri-tip sandwiches are all named after downtown streets. And the Divisadero, because that was our original location, that's our original sandwich. It's the go-to for everybody. Nice, so I get the go-to sandwich. Yeah. All right, well, let's do it. Okay. I'm so excited to peek behind the curtain to see the secrets behind this fan favorite, the Divisadero. Let's head to the kitchen. So uh, Eric's slicing our tri-tip here. We uh, smoke it for 45 minutes to an hour. We pull it off and we let it rest in the tubs. He won't cut it unless it's been sitting for at least 20 minutes. Let that juice really... Yeah, we get this nice juicy slice that he's doing and... Love the knife work. Tri-tip will change grain on you and if you cut with the grain, it makes it real chewy. And Eric is very particular about making sure his tri-tip's not chewy. So while Eric's gonna finish slicing this, let's get over here and get our bread toasting so we can make our sandwich. Let's do it. So this is our Basque Bakery Rolls. They come in 24 inch long sticks. We slice them up into six inch rolls every day. Our secret to our toasty bread is a little slather of mayonnaise on it. So then we're gonna take it, we're gonna put it on our flat top and toast it. The Divisadero gets seven ounces, so almost a half a pound of meat. And we dip it in our au jus here. So the au jus will warm it up just enough to stand up on the bread. So then we line our, our meat up on here and then just a, a handful of fresh yellow onions. Okay, so Jason, now the sandwich made, choice is up to you. Is it spicy or a regular barbecue sauce? We do the dance with it? Yeah. Let's go spicy. Okay, spicy it is. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Give me that sauce. <laughs> There you go, Jason, it's all yours. Love it, thank you. <laughs> I am so excited, this looks amazing. You've got our house made barbecue sauce on there. When you go to bite into something that looks this delicious and juicy, you've got to have a napkin, especially if you're gonna be on camera, right? <laughs> all right. Now I get why you are the people's champ right here. That is so tender, so flavorful. So they having another tri-tip throwdown this they year? They are having another tri-tip throwdown and we're going back. Reigning champion, people's champ. Yeah, we're gonna try, try to take judges choice too this year. <laughs> so just the tip will be open until first pitch and all the Fresno Grizzlies home games. Yep. That's fantastic. And soccer? And soccer games will be open until uh, they open. Most of them are at seven. There's a couple of Sunday games at one. Do I need to pre-order or do I just like stand out the line? It... We'll be ready and waiting for you. Love it. Well, this is really good, by the way. <laughs> <laughs> Jason doesn't mind if I have to shoot again. <laughs> All right. Uh, Mariah's gonna get a call from us next week. You know, the camera was broken. <laughs> Jason, come back out. <laughs> what else is there to say? 
In Tri-Tip City, these folks are the best of the best. If you're into Tri-Tip, and who isn't, you've got to go and try just the tip. It's that simple. For more information about the people, the places, the lifestyle, and this amazing food that our Valley continues to put out, check out fresyes.com.